big bruising characters. Yep. Uh, he's still big and bruising. He's just a, he's just a general now. He's just a general. He's not the emperor. Right. He's got a new weapon, new moveset. set. Uh, a bit of a stance character, but I wouldn't say in the same vein as like a Kenshi. Right. But definitely when he has axe in his hand, axe out of his hand. When it's out of his hand, be careful when you're near the axe. That's all I'm going to say. Uh, let's take a look at how he works. Let's go. So, big thing, just to show, this is kind of the thesis statement, just just swings for the fences. He's a right? powerhouse. This is back two, it, it has advantage. Nice. So if you're blocking, don't want to push any buttons probably. Woo, the pushback. Yeah, I was just there. jabbing. Don't call do that. General shots like hit. calling to right. our X-Facts. Um, great move there. Um, this is a really quick, kind of almost get a little distance to it too. Like I can get you from there. Like really nice. Kind of can lead in some combos. Right. Uh, Sean punishing looks good. move I like to use is the, is is this right here. Very fast, bounces them up. We can show some more stuff with that later. But obviously, you can see there's some pathways with that move. I also really like how his kick attacks are just either uses his axe or he's just huge big boots. <laughs> just Shall like yeah. standard I'm big boots. Too. And they all like look a lot of people, I enjoy the two-player animation strings. Right. Uh, so, so we have cool. he has this overhead. Doesn't combo in anything, but hit the throw button afterwards. So good. And he also has a low one as well. Oh yeah, the low eight. And I'm sure we'll come back to those later as well. Right. Uh, now let's talk about his special moves. Okay. Uh, his special move, the one that kind of encapsulates what he is, is power strike. He will just throw the axe on the ground, and there it is. And you have about seven, eight seconds just to do stuff without the axe, right? You can also call it back. So, okay. Ooh, now, nice. when it's on the ground, different strings. That's back, back one. Nice. He I also, love that I get to I get see the axe him back after it. The grab. That's so, so all cool. of his axe moves get replaced with different normal attacks. Yes. And some are faster. Some have different reactions. Right. Some uh, and some change some of your other special moves. We'll get to that in a second. Even his throw changes. Yes. Even his throw. So here's his throw. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. While we're at it, let's just show the, you know, Matara. Damn, well. we got Matara! And then with the axe, he just bangs in the face with the axe. Right. Other specials he has. So you can huge, without the meter burn, you got a full screen oh, wow. projectile. Oh. Now if you're close, you can, sorry about that, you can do some, some of this. Pops yeah. up. Launch nice. Right. nice. 199 um, he has without a, buff. a cameo, almost 20%. This makes your axe damp uh, power do more damage. You can okay. also meter EX that to get more time on it as well. Um, big move in his arsenal that also leads to a lot of crazy good damage is his also his uh, armored launcher is his knee. He's kind of representing, uh, kind of makes me think of the MK3 like up shoulder, except now it's a knee. Right, and it you can you, you can throw that out a lot of places. Always there. But if you uh, EX the knee, you get a free power slam after that. EX the knee? So you can do like a? that. Okay. And then his axe is on the ground again. Okay. So that's how you rotate throughout the character, right? And now it's on the ground, now it's back to me. So then you can start doing really cool stuff like that's crazy. This into into power slam, back into that. Nice. And that's a pretty nice I'd be happy chunky to combo. See and now you have the axe back. Right. When the axe is on the ground, other cool things can happen. Power slam. Now. I have Another ground one. Oh my god. Neat. Now here's the interesting thing. When you are on the axe, it is an overhead low. Okay. Which is kind of tough to block. Yeah. You can also, you it's know, throw this down. It's overhead when you buy the axe. Uh, do this. Combo and that's action. like a quick recall. Right. Yeah, so if you have it down, you also have a move where you can speed near it, and it's very fast. Slash. Okay. Um, so a lot of really cool stuff you can do. And he's, so he's clearly meant to be going in and out during yes. the fight. In the middle of combos, getting it back at the end of combos. Maybe recalling it if you want to. Right. Lots of stuff like that. But if you are, oh as, a, as my opponent, he's near the axe, there's a lot Here's of stuff you need to think about. Right. So it's I almost like with the axe, you have, you know, kind of 
really good range, not the quickest Pretty range. Much. Without the axe, you're much quicker, and yes. you can use it. And it's all touch. Establish touch. the axe on the screen, and you're going to have to respect it, and that's going to kind of open up your grabs, right. your mix-ups, stuff like that. And it's super cool. Um, you can also, like, he also, you know, he has some, just pick stuff out of the air and that sort of thing. I mean, the, the, oh my the God, knee in the power, power, uh, power strike is huge. Right. Right. Really important. Big boy um, Make sure I'm not missing anything. I do want to show some stuff with Motaro. Okay. So Motaro has a couple things you can use. Now, obviously, Ooh. I'm a big guy. Prop projectiles might scare me. Right. Well, I can do this. I can uh, pull them out and walk I behind it. it. You don't want to be thrown so much. That's so good. So that good. will reflect. And it I'm, takes I'm so walking long. it down. They're forever. I love that, you know, that's a way to call back to his thick, reflex skin from MK3. Right. Yeah. And now Is you're kind of, you, now you're, you're a little confused. What do you do? Boom, you're, you're nice. Hit. He also has this, this turret he can do. Oh my god. To shoot uh, three shots at you. Has a low one too, he can do that. Now here's something that I've chosen Matara with General Shao for a reason. Okay. Remember this move. Yes. Can't, can't do a lot out of it. Right. He has this teleport, right? Okay. Maybe you can read his projectile, maybe not, but you can move around the battlefield quicker as General right. Shao. But with this overhead, I can teleport. That's a signature move. And still and continue a, a combo. combo. It's a true combo. So now you have to worry about this, and you have to worry about uh, something like this. Oh my god. Like that's now in play. That's right. crazy. So you, and you can do the full, uh, the full thing too. You can do, like. It's still a combo. It's a real what one. What a cool real. example of one of my favorite things about the Kami system. It right. allows you to break the rules and restrictions. 33%. And average. I think that's why hits. I love uh, Shao so much is that he breaks the rules also with the knee in that's the power nuts. He's, right. That's nuts. It's a special and a special, which Johnny can do too. Of course, he breaks that rule at times with his uh, meter, with his height meter. But yeah, that, there's a lot of cool, fun sort of breaking the meta of what Shao is just so you can do with that. And really I think cool. it's so neat about the cameo system. You kind of look at your play style, look at your character Very and think, what are my weaknesses? What are the things I think I'm missing? And you can use your cameo to turn those weaknesses into strengths. Right. And you know, for me, it's like, if I'm so far away from people just as a zoner, just even having even having this just to to, to get me out of, out of dodge, right? Right. Now I'm close again. Now and you're now close. You're, now you don't want to be there. Um, let's, do you want, let's show the... Uh, Oh, when you turn up to do yeah, the... Yeah, give yourself a uh, 1%. We'll do that real quick. Show the uh, fatal blow. It's a real good one. Drops it from the sky. Oh my god, that's crazy. Oh, he's not horsing around. Oh, well, <laughs> not horsing around, dead. Ah! Oh my god, I was so fired. General Shao. Pretty cool. Super fun. Uh, I've had a really good time playing with them. Um, just a different style of fighting, different than you're used to for General Shao. So right. it's been a really cool time. Yeah, and I think it's really neat. You know, we also show Gear as having these big brute characters who you might think is like, oh, they're brain dead brawlers or whatever. And no, in this game, no, they're not. They're definitely, you know, really interesting, nuanced characters. It's really cool. Or they can wow. just swing an axe as hard as they want. Or you could just do back to over and over again and be.